Welcome back, friends of Palmetto Grill and Smoke. Today we're going to be doing a boneless leg of lamb from Costco. Um, it's already in a net, so I don't have to worry about that. I'm going to leave the net on to kind of keep its shape as I smoke it. We're going to be going low and slow at about 225. I'm thinking about four hours-ish. I'm going to have this on by noon, and uh, we're shooting for dinner at five today. So I'm going to just get this out of its packaging. We're gonna use some olive oil as a binder, some garlic, some W sauce, and some Kinder's steak blend and wood fired garlic seasoning, which is gonna be our seasoning for today. So we're just gonna get some olive oil on this bad boy. go. Now we're going to drop some W sauce. I've been seeing this online, finally ordered some. I really enjoy it. It's a lot thicker than your norm normal uh, Worcestershire sauce. Which of you? It's one of the hardest things to pronounce. I like the people that say wash your sister sauce. I get a chuckle out of that. But this one is very succinctly called W sauce. It's by Baron Burton's. And I've just been using it fairly recently and I'm definitely enjoying it. All right, so we got that on there. I'm gonna add some minced garlic. Hello, so now I'm gonna come in with my Kinder's steak blend seasoning. My friend Steve just showed up. We've been working on his Jeep this weekend, putting in some armor light flooring. And uh, boy, what a difference does that stuff make? Especially living here at the beach where you don't get your, your car full of sand and much easier cleanup. So we just have a couple odds and ends to finish up after I get this thing ready for the smoker. All right, just get the end here a little bit. All right, this is looking good, folks. Now I'm gonna come in, finish it off with the Kinder's wood-fired garlic seasoning. I'm in love with this stuff. I am legit really in love with this stuff. Here comes our lamb on the smoke. See in several hours. All right, my meter probe thermometer just told me we're at 125 internal on the lamb. Time to bring her off the smoker and let her rest. Look at that. You can see I've got a, a chicken on too. Oh yeah. All right, time to rest. All right, so we're in the cooler. I've got a um, Pyrex measuring cup full of water that I nuked. It's really hot. It's not boiling, but it's really hot. So that'll help keep this cooler warm. And then I'm gonna put a towel on top of this as well to give it some additional insulation. And this can rest in here for hours. We're uh, two hours away from dinner time and that'll be fine. I'll pull it out about 15, 20 minutes before dinner and we'll give it a hot sear on a grill. All right, our lamb's done after a rest and a sear. She's ready to go. One of our neighbors brought ham. We've got a chicken. She's got all kinds of size. We're all gonna be eating well today, but. We're gonna carve into this and see what we've got. Mmm. Oh, that's looking pretty good, folks. Here we go. We pulled this at 125 internal. It rested its way up to a buck 30. So we're at a medium rare, and this looks beautiful. So we're gonna do a quick taste test here. One of my neighbor's children apparently is a really big fan of lamb, so Levi, come on over here and take a bite. Tell me what you think. Mmm. <laughs> oh. Mm. oh, man. <laughs> oh, he's smiling. <laughs> mm. Sit down now. <laughs> Delicious. All right, I'm going to carve the rest of this up. Hey, please check back to Palmetto Grill and Smoke often, folks. 
We're cooking a lot of different things here. As you can see, everything from lamb to chicken to ham, you name it, we're cooking it. Click, follow, like, subscribe, whatever the hell it is on whatever hell social network you're on. Please stick around.